All right. We are back. I had a snafu where inexplicably when I went into here to start part eight of this tutorial, the game had taken away all my shotgun ammo. So I just redid the high school. Um, ironically, I now have the amount of shotgun ammo I had in the lost video. Although I did take damage, a runner grabbed me. So Joel does not have a lot of health here. So, key here. You throw the Molotov at the bloater, and he needs to come back into the fire. That's pretty key. Starts burning again. One. Two. Three. I cannot afford to get hit by the runners. And again, that's because when I redid the high school, I got grabbed early on. Oh, what the hell? Joel, uh, Joel. <laughs> Still getting grabbed is good. The runner cannot hit you then. Now, we have some time to kill here, so... Obviously, I could take... Um, I could give myself health. I don't particularly time. want to. Uh, I did mention earlier that these these two health kits are default things. You get one for free in the slums, and then I picked one up in the museum. So I didn't have to craft them. I use one in winter. And then I have one that I can use whenever. So, like I said, I could take one here. I would prefer not to save it for later in case something happens. Um, now as for... So he drops three, always. I would like the runners to drop something. However, given my health situation that two drop down at the same time, I am going to use one of my shotgun shells. But I'm going to let the guy drop. Because one of the things that will happen here is... If you shoot the guy up there, you'll get the troll drop in the inaccessible area up there, and I don't want that. Now, we can live, by the way, if it's just the three from him and the shotgun shells we get and Frank says. Well, that's doable for truck push, but more is always better. Uh, now, let me just think about what I want out for um, truck push. I mean, I have time to do that later, but let's, uh, let's go, people. hoist. Now, did I go in the closet and grab the parts? I don't remember. I will double check. I think I did. I was talking, so... Actually, sometimes you can get the two for here. The two for one. Not quite. So... Oh, there we go. He dropped. I mentioned before that the game, for some reason, tends to reward you more for when you have one bullet or one shell versus none. But, ah, there we go. Okay, I did grab these. Okay, so we did well. So, two of those guys dropped. That's excellent. We got the slow loading on the shotgun, so it's going to take forever. There we go. Joel? All right, oh, all right. we only have four right now. All right. So, for the ladder here, two things you want to do. When you hop off this thing, if Bill will get out of my way... You want to get ahead of Bill, and you want to be on an angle when you hit the ladder. If something happens, and Bill gets ahead of you, or you just mess up the ladder, move backwards, get out of the way of the runner, or if you really have to, punch him out. Um, but most, you, I found you can deke him out. There's a video of me doing that somewhere, but yeah, you can deke him out. I think that's it for granted. There was a little bit of health there, which is good. Uh, as for our pill situation, because we upgraded weapon sway, we don't have much. In terms of our supplies, so we still have that free shiv from the shiv trick back at Bill's Town. Our situation with alcohol and rags is not much different from last time. And I could make another one of these, but I have no use for it at the moment, so we're not going to. Ah, and you do want this out. It's the first time we're going to use this gun in this playthrough. So, yeah, let's do it. we're going to shoot the 9 mil at the clicker the moment he spawns in, and we're doing that to despawn two other runners who would normally appear. Keep so, foot on the clutch. we're going to push the truck with Bill here. And when we stop, and you gain control of Joel, you're going to just move a little bit closer. 
Got the 9 mil. And it, it doesn't matter if you hit him or not. That's not relevant. And then you want to put this... You want to switch because you're not going to use the 9 mil again for a long time. But you see, there's just a clicker. Joel's going to take forever to reload because he does that sometimes. But yeah, that saved us fighting two runners. And that's excellent. Alright, and my goal here generally is to use the shotgun as little as possible. That's more of just like a personal thing. You can go ham here. The shotgun is of limited use um, for quite a long time here, but waste not, want not is kind of the way I look at it. We obviously need it for the clicker. But you can just punch these ladies out. Oh. Clicker's a little... Oh, good. Okay, he grabbed Bill. That's ideal. That's what you wanted to do. Look at these two. So there's a bottle there if you've used your um, throwable, and there's also a bottle uh, actually just up here. You don't need to keep throwable too for Pittsburgh. There's throwables you can grab, so... I think it's good to shotgun at least one of the runners there. It's, it's not really what you want Bill to do. And uh, we're doing a little dance here. Go, 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 go. I'm mostly worried about the runners, because I'm so hurt. Come here. Come here, clicker. Joel's going to take forever to reload. Where's the dam? Oh, we got the bottle, we got that out, we're good to go. You can see it's it's not right, it's not super ready. difficult. You can move around, you don't want to go too far away from the truck or it'll spawn right, an extra go. runner, but broadly speaking, you know, it's pretty straightforward. And I saved some shotgun ammo. Uh, the main place I use the shotgun again is, is towards the end of Pittsburgh at the uh, spotlight fight. Anyway, though, that wraps up Billstown. And we will come back with probably my favorite chapter in the game, Pittsburgh.